The main reason why I wanted to practice law is because the objective of my life has always been to make a difference in the lives of other people. So I saw myself using the law as an instrument to make that impact. When I had financial challenges, I felt like it was a potential drawback. Well, challenges are overcome. So essentially, the power that was within is what actually propelled me, you know, to overcome challenges. My upbringing, you could say that it was bittersweet. I was born to my mother, who was a domestic worker then. My father passed on when I was in grade four, obviously leaving my mother to fend for us, her children. Then I moved to Renfontein to live with my maternal grandmother. I also experienced the, the sweetness of life. I've always excelled in my studies. That gave me joy, that gave me fulfillment, it gave me a hope uh, for a better future. And I believe that future that I had hope for is the future that I'm now living in, you know, and experiencing, and it's wonderful. During my varsity days, I had financial struggles. I couldn't afford university life. I couldn't afford my tertiary education, including textbooks. But I had friends who came to know about my financial struggle, and they decided to do something. They contributed towards my education fees. They fed me. In general, they took care of my welfare. They were good friends and for, for that I am grateful.